Hi, it's Therese from Lost in Paper and back with another card in my series Cards for Men. And this might look like a bit of a mess to you, but this is basically what my desk looks like if I'm making a graffiti card. And it's one of my favourite style of cards to make for men and a lot of fun too because you get to use heaps of different stamps. And I'm going to be doing a bit of die cutting as well. So stick with me and we'll see what we end up with because I'm not really sure yet. I'm going to be winging this one see how we go. Now to start my little marathon I've got some smoky grey ink and one of the speech bubbles from Lawn Fawns a birdie told me. And I'll stamp that and then I'll use one of the matching dies and run that through my die cutting machine. So I've also die cut a dark blue teal colour, number two, from My Favourite Things High Rise number set. So I've got a piece of plain white cardstock and it's cut the same size as the front panel of my card and I'm just going to run this speech bubble die through my die cutting machine. So I'll just turn my panel over and pop my die cut straight into position. And I've got some adhesive on some type of paper that I'm just sitting over the back to hold that in place because I'm going to be running this through the die cutting machine again, this time with the number two. And I'll just gently remove my tape. So I've just put my number into place there and I'll use just a piece of typing paper again to hold that in place, it's some adhesive. So now it's simply just a matter of playing with my stamps and working out what fonts and what um, sentiments I want where and stamping them out. I've got this happy birthday stamp, it's uh, Hero Arts. Yeah. It's your day. And I've got some Versafine Onyx Black ink. And because I'm going to be stamping this over the die cuts, I know it's not going to work extremely well. Oh, I'll just get my stamp my jig at the ready. Just in case I do need to stamp it again. So that's pretty good. So I decided on the smaller U from the big U stamp set from Simon Says, and I've got some lime green. So I use my stamp runner to attach this to the front of my card, which is cut the same size. Oops. I'm really liking this stamp runner. The um, adhesive seems to hold really well and it goes on nice and easy. It's not too big to hold in your hand either. And it's actually quite good value. I'll simply just flip this over and cut the end of this die cut that's sitting outside. I thought I might just add a couple of little 
enamel dots. So one of my favourite techniques, especially for a masculine card and a great way to have a lot of fun with all your stamps and just seeing what you can put together and stick to the keep it simple theory, make a mess theory, I'm not sure what you want to call it, but have heaps of fun. So I'll see you again real soon. Until then, happy paper crafting. Bye.